In this video that was recorded in front of a live studio audience on Twitch, T tells the story of how Tamika met Yo Daddies. How she goes from person to person, man to man, to collect her donation as needed in order to build her empire, or shall she say, legacy for the future of the Gaffneys. Please stay tuned. Genealogy list. Okay, so we currently have seven children, okay? If you're new here, let's go down the list for you all. Okay, firstborn is Heaven Gaffney. Now, if you don't know, his daddy is Baco Jank. Now, his daddy technically was supposed to be uh, the meathead man, but he married, what's that lady name? The, 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 I don't remember that lady name, whatever. I don't know. He was supposed to, she was supposed to, he was supposed to be with meathead, meathead, muscle, muscular guy. But he basically was like playing hard to get and all that extra stuff. And Baco was like available because, you know, they got like five, six cats, only got one daughter and he wanted another kid. Back a boo, boo. They, they pop and dop and bop and boom, they had heaven. Heaven has been to his daddy house multiple times. And the, you know, the sister tried to accept him, but the daddy it, it did the same thing. Um, he was supposed to be at heaven's birth, but he couldn't make it. Apparently he had to go to some show. He sent the wife there to, to go. Cause we showed up at the house, you know, I mean, we knew that he was married and everything like that, but it wasn't my fault. Angela in the chat said that I needed to, you know, get with the married men anyway. Cause I wasn't even trying to do that, but that was Angela's call, but we did what we did. And everything but the wife was supposed to drop me off which she did she was supposed to stay with me but she left me at the hospital and then went ahead and told him that she dropped me that she was there with me the whole time and, at, and sat up there and lied and said that she did like whatever it was is what it is so heaven ended up stealing from somebody's house and the daddy said that heaven was not welcomed at their house no more because he didn't allow thieves at his house so now heaven and his daddy don't see eye to eye no more. But then heaven's daddy pulled up to the house talking about he want to have a relationship with heaven. So heaven's like, okay, daddy, you know, this and that and other. And then heaven goes to the house again, only to be ignored again. Now, you know, heaven has like these little issues or whatever with dreadhead man, because dreadhead man done, you know, you know, dreadhead man, we're going to introduce y'all to dreadhead man. Okay. This is Dreadhead Man right here, David Lucas. Now, Mr. Dreadhead Man, you know, he did destroy Heaven's doghouse like six times and everything like that. Apparently, it was my fault that I allowed Dreadhead Man to, to, to destroy Heaven's house. I technically didn't. I fixed it every time, and I did address Dreadhead Man from destroying on Heaven's house. I personally didn't see Dreadhead Man destroy Heaven's house. Heaven didn't personally see me him destroy his house it was just destroyed when heaven went in there i mean maybe he did see him like a couple of times but you know we we, we fixed it and then we kicked dreadhead me out after snapping on dreadhead me and taking his donation but that's not here adele and that's how we got jordy and nay after we got <laughs> after we got um his donation when so we got heaven's beautiful uh twin brothers and sisters Nate and Jordy from Dreadhead Man, which he didn't actually want to leave, so we had to like kick him out and call the police and everything like that because he didn't want to leave. I was like, Damn, you're not gonna leave, okay? So then, Noctrin, baby, y'all, that he got another baby. Oh my gosh, I told y'all he had another baby. Oh my goodness, y'all, this is it's it's it's, it's 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 so much drama. So Mateo ass and Dreadhead Man actually have a relationship together because they was the one they met at my house and put me on with uh Dreadhead Man put me on with Mateo because Dreadhead Man and Mateo actually had a relationship together before they even had relationships with me and they agreed to fill out the application to give me the donations that I needed to have Nate and Jordy and Dez and Nocturne, right? So they all been here kissing and everything like that. So, you know, I join in and everything like that. You know, I'm saying I, but it's Tamika, right? And, you know, they giving, you know, sperm line everywhere. So, you know, we catching in a cup or whatever. Anyway, so we get the, you know, donation and everything like that. And, but Mateo over here is engaged, but then he divorced his other wife, which who is, uh, Tommy's mama, 
who was Lucia Markov Markovic, who was at the house when we visited Mateo, who was pregnant with Mateo's baby, and Summer was pregnant too. And they don't had a baby with, who was Alveda. I'm thinking, I mean, I, that sounds like Velveeta, but whatever they want in their baby, that's not that's not my problem. Who was Alveda? And then she was pregnant by, I'm assuming, Mateo, but his name is Victor. I mean, I'm just saying they don't even look like his baby, but that's that's not my problem. Okay, they might need to go to Murray or something, but you know what I'm saying? They ain't got nothing to do with me. You know how the skins are in this game. So you know what I'm saying? That you know what I'm saying? I I can't I can't do nothing about that. But apparently that's my half. That's 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 Nocturne. And and there's his half brother. Right here. That's their half sister Alvita, aka Velveeta, Mac and Cheese, and Victor. So he done bopped and dop his ex-wife and his new wife. They live in the same house. And then this is Giovanni, who is a half brother, but he don't even know who his other mama is. <laughs> it's just so much. Like he don't even know who his mama is. So he got two, he got two step mamas and a step baby mama. I, I think I'm his step baby mom, step mama, two step mama removed. Shit, I don't know what I am. I, th I guess I'm his stepmama removed or something or whatever, but that's the Nocturne's brother, but I'm, that's, I'm his stepmama removed or something because I was in a relationship with his daddy. So I'm his stepmama removed. So, you know what I'm saying? We just had relations. He was like an applicant and stuff. Yeah, it's, it's a mess. And then Sama, you know what I'm saying? You know, Sama was a nice guy. I ain't had no problem with her. You know what I'm saying? You know, I didn't even know he was a, engaged to him because they was over here. He was with Redhead to introduce with me. So I'm like, shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, pull up, you know? And he still come over and everything, you know? So then, brings me to my next, let me get back on track. Brings me to our next thing, okay? Damona's daddy. <laughs> Damona's daddy is Brent. Now, Brent's situation is a little different, you know what I'm saying? He married to Brent, oh, stank and snake ass, okay? So, Brent was crying one day, you know, I was like, little Brent, you know, you know, I'm gonna be honest with you. Like, you know, I, I said, hey, Brent, you know, I'm new here to the Sims world and everything like that, you know, and I'm looking for some applicants who is willing to, you know, be a part of this legacy. And if you want to take part of that, feel free to sign up, everything like that. What you'll have to do is you know, you'll have to live in a gated community for some time, or you don't have to, but you know, you have to spend a night with me, blah, 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 this and that and that. But he's like, oh, I don't want to do that. You know, I'm faithful to my husband, which he not. He know he ain't fucking faithful, but whatever. He didn't want to be a part of it. But then he found out that Brent ass was cheating on him. You know, in everybody game, you know, Brent and Brent, they hoes in everybody game. Y'all know that. Go play for, go play in your save, Brent and Brent. Y'all going to see they out here fucking other people. Just go in your save and y'all will see. Okay. So he come over. And he's crying and stuff on Tamika's shoulder, talking about, oh my gosh, I just found out that Brent is still cheating on me and all, everything like that. And I'm like, mm-hmm, and everything. I'm like, it's okay and everything like that. So about this application that you wanted to be a part of, I'm trying to tell you, you're going to be a part of something special. Your legacy is going to live on, blah, 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 blah. I can give you something that Brent can't, blah, 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 blah. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Mind you, I'm like, this is a two for one. If I can get Brent, I know for sure I can get Brent as well, too. But they both pose like, hello. So, yeah. So after that, you know, he was like, all right, I can do it. So he pull up with his little bag. You know how they like pull up with their little suitcase and shit now? They like, he like pull up with his little bag and everything. His little suitcase. He spent like the whole weekend like shit. I, I don't know what it was, but he must have got put it on him and everything like that. He asked to be... He was like pulling up afterwards. I'm like, I want to marry you. I'm going to be your girlfriend. I'll leave my husband for you. All that stuff like that. I'm like, Brent, no, honey, you got to go back home. You got to go back home to your husband. Like, this not how, this not part of the deal. You can't be here. Like, but I'll still let you see your, your daughter, Damona. So 
I, you know, he got upset about that. So he like, you know what I'm saying? He was like, well, fuck them kids. So he didn't come see Damona. So I brought Damona to him. And so I, he, I guess he like made up with Brent and everything like that. So he was trying to be all funny and everything. And like, he didn't want to see Damona. So I was like, oh, let me introduce you, Brent, to your stepdaughter, okay? That your husband done made with me by filling out this application on, okay? Yeah, yes, he did say that. He showed his stuff on. The couple is Brent and Brent. Brent and Brent. Um, yeah, right here. Their name is um Brent Hecken and Brent Hecken. Yeah. Stepfather. And uh the father. Yep. I'm gonna I'm gonna take y'all to this house. Mm-hmm. So, oh, he was so mad, y'all. I have I was like, here's your stepdaughter. Right here, but oh y'all, he was so mad. Y'all should have saw how he was eyeballing. Ooh, shot, he was so mad. And everything. But he got over and everything like that. So you know I'm trying to put, you know, that's gonna be like the next baby dad. I'm trying to like, you know, lose it over and everything with him and everything. Cause Brent, hey, like Brent kind of pulled up to the house again. He started crying again. He he got mad again and came to the house and tried to like do whatever. And then he was like, Oh, we made up and everything like that. I was like, Okay, that's good for you, Brent. Like, what you doing over here? Do you want to see Demona or whatever? Demona's old enough to make her own decisions now. She's in high school. So if she wanna see you, she gonna call you herself. Like if she's not calling you, that's not that's not a me problem, that's a you problem. So you need to be reaching out to her. Whatever, whatever. So, you know, whatever. So what you doing over here, Brent? Like, hello? So he coming over, trying to help me clean up and cook and shit. I'm like, all right, whatever. So I'm like, okay. So I guess he want like a little quickie or whatever. So I was like, okay, Brent. So, and then he's like, he talks to the hand. You know how they do that little talk to the same hand and shit. And he didn't want that. So I said, all right, bet. So don't fuck with me no more. Like, boop, don't, like, you would never get another taste of this. Like, goodbye. You know? Because you know, with the 100 Baby Challenge, like, you can't do... You can still fuck or whatever, but you can't do no double dipping. Like, you know, you can't have no other baby, but you can still lick the patty whacker. You know what I mean? Like, whatever. And, um, did we go up all the babies? Yeah. Oh, mm-hmm. But yeah, that's what I was, I was like, oh my goodness. Like, what's going on? Y'all, it was just, I was like, what is going on? Does he have a, he ain't got nobody yet. He a support agent. He finally got a job.